Polygon has finally taken a break. You're probably wondering what the hell is Polygon? What happened to Polygon? Why is the price exploding? I'm here to tell you exactly what is going on. Please stay tuned for the rest of the show. You are now tuned in to Wisen Up TV. I am your host, the one and only Wisen Up, aka you, God BKA, Jay the Giant Slayer, chilling here this lovely afternoon, morning, night, whatever it may be for you. And I'm about to cover the Polygon token and the entire Polygon ecosystem to let you guys know what is happening the opportunity at hand is it too late to invest in polygon or should i just focus on another token first off let's just go ahead and jump into the price where it's at right now polygon sending at 0 0.78 cents 78 cents and uh i've kind of got in right around actually before january i got it in about november and it was like about a cent and a half. Yeah, I got in to Polygon right around here. Looking really nice. Oh, almost two cent right around here. Cent and a half, a little bit over a cent and a half. So I've rode this whole entire wave. I've made a couple uh, exits. I'm, or should I say skimmed a little bit off the top and took some profits. But I'm, I'm still in the project for the long term. But uh, a lot of gains have been made. And people want to know, is there still opportunity in Polygon? And the answer to that is, I think there is. But the uh, I think long term may not be as much as we may want. Being that Ethereum 2.0 could possibly do a lot more scaling than we think. And solve problems that Polygon are actually trying to fix. Interoperability, scalability, things of this nature. But let's pop right into what Polygon is what they've done with their ecosystem and how they're actually helping everything flow a little bit smoother in the cryptocurrency fit network ecosystems all right right here polygon we're on the polygon network ethereum's internet of blockchains polygon is a protocol and framework for building and connecting ethereum ethereum compatible blockchain networks so what they're doing here is they are uh uh interoper interoperability chain that are connecting blockchains together if you are using what is called the ethereum virtual machine which other blockchains use are they able to uh, easily integrate into ethereum okay so that's what that is and what they've done is they've created a uh, thing similar to uniswap which is a clone uh, and then uh, which was cloned uh, uh, by sushi swap which was cloned by pancake swap which all these swaps have been doing and you have now a quick swap which is on the matic network and this is uh, interesting because it's a lot cheaper as far as gas fees goes and there are uh, assets that you can bridge over onto the matic network and then exchange them on the quick swap so I'm not going to go into how to bridge them over, but it's really, really simple how to bridge them over. You go into this web wallet right here, uh, uh, the, the Matic web wallet. You, uh, into, you put in your tokens, you bridge them over, and bam, you're ready to go. And you need just like a MetaMask wallet or something like that. So it's pretty similar to any of these swaps that uh, have been going on, if you've been familiar with these swaps. Um, so that's how that works, the quick swap. And what's interesting about quick swap, though, is that this quick swap token has exploded insanely just as well as has the polygon token now it's down 35 percent so it's gone a crazy crash but it was up to uh, a little bit over 1400 dollars usd uh, um, for one coin at the top of its coin and what this quick swap coin is it's it's similar to your uniswap token or your sushi swap token it is the that you're paid in this token for adding liquidity to the network and so that's what that is and, it's, and these tokens are pretty expensive already um, depending on how this 
uh, network does, they could actually bounce back from here. We'll see what happens. But there's a lot of other networks that are going to be coming out opposed to this one. And I'm going to be covering uh, one of the biggest ones that's going to happen if you guys aren't aware of it. And it has to do with XRP. So I'll cover that in a later video. But let's go into Twitter. Uh, if you guys aren't following me on Twitter, please follow me at Wisen Up. Um, I am there. I like to post up my uh, new videos, and also I like to uh, talk shit about things as well here to here. I uh, also say funny stuff too. So yeah, follow me on Twitter. That's what it is. So we're gonna pop into the news and what's happening. Still, uh, we're gonna continue with Polygon. And we're, we're going to talk about the first DeFi project built on the Polygon network. So they have the Quick Swap, which is the Uniswap of the Polygon network. And now they have the Polywell.Binance, which is the first DeFi protocol built on top of the Matic slash Polygon network. And this is pretty interesting. It popped off really hard. If you were in it when it first started, the first couple of days, there were a lot. There was a lot of money to be made for sure. Uh, let's pop right into the actual Polygon Finance well, website, and let me show you what's what how it works really quick. So they have the Ocean, the tanks. The Ocean is farming, so you can put in Krill, which is the native token for this platform, and you can put USDC. And as you can see, the APR absolutely ridiculous right now. Uh, two thousand and two hundred and fifty two percent that is not a joke that is the real APR who knows how long that will last but they are giving that out and the tank here is your um, staking pools so right here you can stake krill you can stake uh, ratmatic rat BTC wrapped ETH quick uh, yield uh, USDT USDT and USDC um, I'm actually participating in one of these farms. The uh, the yield uh, I threw some in there. It's acquired, I think, like four krill. Krill right now is about sixty four dollars. So I acquired that. That's sixty four times. Uh, I think I might have bought five. So five bought three hundred and twenty dollars in about three days. So about a hundred bucks a day is what this is averaging as far as this staking pool but I did stake about 4800 I think to five thousand dollars worth of uh, yield tokens to produce that but nevertheless that's not too bad actually over farm that's pretty effective but you do but even at this high of APR you do have to have a little bit uh, of money in there so yeah the APRs are, are high uh, the rap Matic is 220 the rap BTC is 196 the wrapped ETH is 190. The quick is uh, 368. So uh, yeah, as you can see, and those two are over 100%. As you can see, the APYs are extremely high and somewhat. Uh, they're not unrealistic. If you guys were in, if you guys were here for the beginning of the DeFi craze, you would see some shit like 30,000% APY out of control. But this is actually um, conservative compared to what things used to do uh, when DeFi projects first came out. I think they were a little bit higher too when this first dropped because this was like 2,000, three, almost 3,000 for the for the yield uh, staking when that first uh, started a couple of days ago. So now it's down to 700, so it's uh, dropped dramatically. And as people get into the pools, the APY drops as well because the percentage has to be split up between the people who are um, into the pool. So um, that is that, guys, when it comes to Polygon, uh, Polymatic Network really quick as um, just a brush over to show you guys what it is and what they're doing and how why the uh, coin has popped off so significantly over the past couple of days um, when you're doing yield farms and when you're doing swaps and your swaps are significantly cheaper than uh, you know uniswap which might charge me you know 60 50 60 maybe even 100 bucks depending on how congested and uh, everything is as far as the gas fees goes people want another source of swapping their money uh, or swapping their current cryptocurrencies into other currencies for a cheaper price so that's how these coins actually blow up and uh, get a little bit of traction 
so anyhow guys thank you for watching I appreciate every single one of my subscribers thank you so much I appreciate the love and I will see you guys on the flip side have yourselves a good morning night afternoon whatever it may be for you and stay tuned for the next video peace